All right, guys, this is what I got. I've got the <coughs> OEM axle right here. This is the top, top one. Then I've got the drive shaft shop axle here underneath. Um, as you can see, it's the uh, same size as what they sent me. Um, looks like it's pretty solid. Uh, the difference between the two is that this comes with an intermediate bar, so it's two pieces. This will pop off. Let me uh, get that. So <clears throat> this will come off. Uh, let me tell you what my problem is with what they sent. This intermediate bar is the wrong bar for. Uh, for this car uh, when you buy a drive shaft shop race axle um, they want you to provide your own bearing this and the bearing carrier right so all the other axles uh, just want you to supply the carrier this one they want you to give your want you to use your old bearing which I have because I have a few sets of axles Problem is, <clears throat> the thing looks like it'll fit lengthwise. The splines here all match up to the OEM on both sides. That's the uh, the hub side. This go this goes into the diff. My problem is with what they sent me. This intermediate bar, uh, the bearing won't fit on it. So. The bearing is in the right spot right here. They even have a C-clip right there for it. Problem is this OEM bearing doesn't fit here. It goes right through. So I can't, oops, I can't press this bearing onto here. As you can see, it's, it's not the right. Uh, with the bar itself so <clears throat> my problem is i can't fit this oem bearing which is this one onto here which would go pretty much where it's supposed to go and having problem getting them to either understand that they sent the wrong intermediate bar and uh so kind of like stuck whether there is a bearing that will fit on here and also have the right outside diameter to fit inside of the the carrier which I have in the garage so that's my problem it looks like it's a pretty decent built axle uh, a little concerned about the intermediate bar I don't know just hope this is not something that could crack but Either way, this bar is not allowing me to install it in my car because I can't put that bearing in. It just doesn't press on, it goes right here. So that's my problem. Uh, does anybody know if there's another bearing that maybe I'm, I've got it wrong, I've got the wrong bearing, but every other axle I have is the same, it's got the same bearing. And this is a part number uh, 83B231. So, anyway.